It is April Fool's Day, but this is no joke. We have the scientist, the chief scientist, with the Imagination Station, Carl Nelson here. We're just hanging out, a couple of guys cooking dinner with a microwave. What's happening? <laughs> so. We're talking about soap oh, today. Oh, okay? Don't eat that. Um, so, you know, ivory soap. You familiar with ivory soap? Yeah. Has this great story, this like marketing spin that uh, a long time ago, um, the reason it floats in water oh. is because somebody left it whipping too long, and there's air whipped inside there, and it floats. Is the, are you taking the bunk out of this? Are you debunking that? No, no okay. I just had to mention that story. That it, it floats. <laughs> like if you take if you take like Irish Springs, um, it sinks. Huh. So we're talking density here too. Yeah. So. You know, all soap has a little bit of moisture inside of it, and ivory has lots of little air pockets. So, so I thought it would be fun. You know, it's April Fool's Day. Why not? Oh, Why not boy. have some fun with the microwave and put sure. a chunk of ivory soap in a microwave and heat up the water that's inside the soap oh. and see what happens. So we're going to leave it in there for a couple seconds. Now, the microwave works because it heats up the water molecules, right? And so those water molecules inside the soap are going to heat up and expand and turn into steam. The same thing happens with gremlins. With gremlins. <laughs> okay, so we've been in here for about, I don't know, 20, 20 seconds or so. I'm going to pull this out quickly. Check that out. Wow. So you get like this little souffle. Yeah. It, it fills up with air, and you can touch it. Touch it. Yeah, Describe it what great. that feels like. Oh, wow. Well, it actually feels more like a marshmallow yeah. that uh, may have cooled. In, yeah, Irish it, Spring. Which you think Irish maybe Spring? it would. There's a little bit of whipped material on the inside here, but yeah. this, this is more light and it doesn't come off on. Uh, it's yeah. light and flow. It's like yeah. a little souffle. Of yeah. Um, and so it's interesting to try different things. I should probably mention that if you're going to try this experiment at home, you know, talk, you know, you're probably not going to want to cook anything in this microwave. Convince your parents. Right afterwards, because it's going to have a lovely floral aroma from all the that perfume. That is true. But it will be clean because it's soap. Isn't it is, that it's, the it's, idea? There's, yeah, this is just, there's nothing wrong with this. You could use this as soap. It's just turned into literally like a souffle. It's been fluffed up with that heated water vapor that was inside the soap. Okay. In fact, we've got, uh, I think this guy, and it's beautiful to watch this, how they just grow inside here. Here we have a little Irish spring. Um, I'll throw some dial in there as well. So go ahead and touch that one. Describe that one for us. Uh, kind of the same thing, but this one stuck together, whereas this one... Yeah, this one like is a, it's a little bit more dense to start with. Right. Now, once we've puffed it up like this, if we drop it in the water, it's going to flow. Yeah, all the air is It's going to flow because it's got a lot of air pockets inside there. Right. It's less dense than the water. Um, yeah. So, uh, you know, I'll leave it to your imagination to figure out what the heck you could do with soap that's been put in the microwave. I just think it's just a really, oh, this is beautiful. Look at that. Wow. It's, it's just gorgeous how it fluffs <laughs> up like that and it turns into that soft, fluffy, I don't know. Only a scientist would describe microwave soap as gorgeous. But that's why we're here at the Imagination Station. If you bring the kids on down today and you live in Lucas County, you have a kid 12 and under, that kid gets in free with a paid adult admission. And today also is April Fool's Day. We know that there is something happening down here behind the scenes. You made a discovery in the depths of the Imagination Station and you're trying to crack it open. What is happening here? We found something in our Lego exhibit okay. that is a, sort of a tease for an upcoming exhibit about dinosaurs. Oh, We've boy. been examining what we found Check out our social media sites and you can find out a little bit more about what we discovered. All right. We're having some fun with it. Yeah, I'm sure. He's having fun with anything you can stick in a microwave here. And we're going to take one last look oh, at the last specimen. Nice. Wow. Isn't that nice? That like is. You hang on your wall. It's, it's a, yeah, a work of art. A boutonniere, and that's how you imagine it. <laughs>